I speak right now? Yes. My name is Alexander Gannon. Okay, the witness is yours, Mr. Saunders. Uh, so, I, I introduced you as uh, AJ. Is that a preferred nickname you go by? Yeah. I'm sorry, uh, but your full, your proper name is Alexander. Yes. Okay. Um, so is it okay if I, I call you that, AJ? That's fine. That's All fine. right. Uh, so AJ, um, uh, how old are you? 25. Uh, do you live in the uh, Green Bay area? Yes. Uh, did you uh, grow up here as well? Yes. Did you go to uh, high school and, and middle school here? Yes. Uh, AJ, do you know somebody by the name of uh, Shad Therian? Yes. And uh, how do you know Shad? I've known him since middle school. Um, and uh, what middle school did you go to, to school with him at? Um, I I think I saw him before a couple times in like the new media, but we mainly ran up at uh, Bayview. Bayview. Okay. Bayview Middle School. Yeah. Okay. Uh, and uh, throughout you know schooling, and I guess now you're an adult. Uh, did you keep in touch with Shad? Well, um, after about like maybe like. It, it was the first year I started. I moved into my apartment. It was when I started really connecting with a lot of people from that brand tour. I've talked with, and Chad was one of them. Okay. So there's a, a reacquainting period, I guess. Yes. All right. Uh, AJ, do you also know somebody named uh, Taylor uh, Coronado or Shad Business? Yes. And how do you know uh, her? Since middle school. Similar to Shad. Yes. Uh, did you remain kind of friendly with, with Taylor as well? Yes. Sorry, is that a yes? Yes. Sorry. Um, so, AJ, I want to ask you about uh, February 21st of 2022. Um, it was a Monday. Do you recall the date I'm talking about? Yes. Okay. So I don't know what when, like, this happened, but I don't know. Sure. Uh, so, do you recall a day where you were... Um, um, I guess hanging out with with oh, Chad and Taylor. Okay, I didn't. You you were saying like the date, but I didn't. Sure. And that context. So. Sure. Um, so I want to ask you then. Uh, I'll ask it this way. Um, at some point, did you become aware that Chad had passed away? It was only, it was only after um, when the day I, before I was heading out to vacation to see my parents. Okay. My dad specifically. And was that in, in February of 22? No, it was like, it was like a week after, I think it was, so it was in February, no, I'm, I went, I went, I had vacation in June, but I don't remember, I'm sorry, I, I have like a, I have like a lot of like mental problems. Sure. So it's like hard to like keep a constant catalog of memories. Sure. So uh, are you referring to when you learned that Shad had passed? Um, so I, I, all I knew was it was like a week. It was a week uh, after like something like that. I don't know for sure. All I knew was basically um, the day after, a couple days after, I had, I was uh, going to the Eastman apartment buildings because that's where I knew Taylor was at at the time. Okay. And ironically, the same day that I went there, the police were knocking on my door specifically okay. to try and get in to reach for me with the situation. And they only the only thing that I knew at the time was basically they asked if I knew the whereabouts of Shad and Taylor. Mm -hmm. So like that's like the that's like the closest thing I can remember. It's just sure, and I so. I know we're talking about something a long time ago, and dates may be a little, a little fuzzy. Is that fair? Yeah, it's just sure. You don't. Yeah, so that hard. so that time you were talking about um, where law enforcement was asking you some questions. Do you remember telling them about a time uh, you were hanging out with Shad and, and Taylor? Yes. Okay. Um, can the you night tell, of. Can which, you tell us about that? Yes. Um, I was drinking a little bit belligerently so it's the only time that I looked at like the clock was like before I left the apartment my apartment so it was like after 10 30 10 around that time frame and like basically it was like uh I I hit up I just 
decided to stop dissociating a lot, and I felt bad for uh, um, for not talking to a whole lot of friends that I used to talk to, like Taylor and Chad. So I just hit up Taylor randomly. I was like, "Hey, like, what's up? Are you going to hang out?" And then uh, basically, I went over to the apartments, and um, when Specifically, uh, when I got there, I was, we were just chilling, chopping it up, like how we always do. And, uh, basically, um, I was, like, Taylor was thinking, asking, like, do you want to, you want to hang out with Shad? She was asking me, like, for consent to hang out with Shad, to, like, to bring him over. And I was like, yeah, that's fine. That's cool. Okay. And so, uh. Could I, could I stop you right there? I'm sorry. I just have a quick question. Um, so when you were said you were at the apartment, was which apartment is this? The Eastman, the Metal View East apartment. Okay. Is that kind of where you you thought Taylor was staying, or, or whose apartment was it? It was um. It, it was the same apartments that um I I lived there. So um. It was like. I'm I'm sorry. What? Sure. So the apartment is on Eastman that you're talking about? Yeah. Okay. And I'm sorry, I interrupted. You were with um, Taylor, and then she brought up hanging out with Shad? Yeah. Did you meet up with Shad that night? Yes, I did. And where were you sort of hanging out with Shad then? Um, we picked him up, went back to the apartment, and was just chopping it up. Is that the same apartment you were just talking about? Yes. All right. And... Uh, I date myself. Uh, chopping it up, what does that mean? Oh, it's just like kicking it, talking about whatever, just small talk or anything. Just, okay. just kind of having conversation. Is it a pretty good chill atmosphere? Yeah, it was a good vibe. No no major you know issues or anything that stick out to you? I never saw one thing that I... I kind of sh Shad was acting normal? Yes, he was. Taylor was acting normal? Yes. Um, and you said this was about 10 o'clock, 10.30 at night? This was when we, this was when I went to the apartment, like okay. around that time frame. All right. Um, and this is still the, the apartment on Eastman? Um, yes. Okay. And then um, at some point, do you uh, leave that ho uh, apartment? I left. I did leave. Okay. I, I left um Probably like at least maybe like a couple hours, maybe until like one, two in the morning. I don't know for sure. It's like I said, I only looked at the time before yeah. I left the apartment, and I was a little drunk. So, okay. But at some point, you left the apartment. Uh, were Shad and Taylor still at the apartment when you left? From what I saw, I I, I don't know, but that's that's what, yes, okay. from what I saw. And then after that point, um, had you ever seen Shad again? What? After that point, after you left that apartment, had you ever seen Chad again? No. Ironically, I hit him up the day after or like a, a couple of days, like like the first week into the situation. And I, I call him, I message him about a song that he posted on his Facebook, which was like some, like some, it was like some rap song that I liked. And I was like, yeah, I just like randomly sent him a message that day I was like yeah that shit's dope and then I was like feeling a little when I when I don't have people talking to me a whole lot I get a little anxious and now I'm like hey what's up like I'm a little concerned immediately okay but like I didn't I like I didn't realize until after I talked my friend mentioned to me specifically about what happened um, and I'm, I'm sorry I'm jumping around in here I, I want to go back to when it was you and, and Taylor and yes. you went to go pick up Shad, is that right? Yes. Okay. How did you pick up Shad? Me. How did you and Taylor go and pick him up? Okay. Well, um, we took a minivan. Uh, who drove? Um, Taylor. Do you know whose minivan that was? No. Okay. Uh, was it a, a, a minivan that was at that apartment that uh, you were at? Yes. And you went to Shad's house to pick him up? Yes. Um, thank you, AJ. I have uh, I have nothing further. Thank you.
Mr. Frelick, do you have any questions? Yes, I do. Mr. Gannon, good afternoon. Um, you knew um, Taylor and Shad since middle school? Yes. Okay. And you went to school at Bayview Middle School? Yes? Yes. And then did you go to high school together as well? A little bit until the freshman year. Okay. Did you go I went to three different high schools in my freshman year. Okay. So did it's bouncing all that. That's okay. Did you go to high school with Taylor Shabizas? Yes. At uh, Bayport? Yes. Okay. And <clears throat> you kind of knew her pretty well, correct? Yes. Enough to associate with her. You were friends with her? Yeah, to associate and be friends with, yes. And was it your understanding that at least in high school, um, Shad Therian and Taylor Shabizas kind of were boyfriend and girlfriend? They dated a little bit? Yes. I don't, I don't know how the connection between them, but uh, it seemed like the... At the time, uh, after uh, the breakup with Corey, it seems like that's like the only person that she always chose with sometimes. That's a, that's a, like, whenever I see Shad, so more times over, I'll, especially when he's, when he's like chilling, I see Taylor or a couple other friends in that circle in there. Okay. They're pretty cool people. Sure. Um. Did you sometimes go over to um, Shad Therian's uh, mother's house, Tara Pakinich, on Stony Brook Lane? Yeah, the year that I moved out, I I visited a couple times, at least a handful of times. Okay, w would you go over there to maybe eat or play video game video games and watch TV? Um, we wouldn't do a whole lot, but I just came. Typically, I was like the I was like the like the runt that would just be chilling with the whole pack, basically, of dogs that we were chilling with, you know what I'm saying? So you, you, like, you just kind of hang out with the group? Yeah, just hanging out with the group. Yes, okay, all right. So. Okay. Um, would you sometimes go over to Shad's uh, father's house, Michael Therian's house? Yes. Okay. And was it such that Shad Therian, he lived with his father, Michael Therian? At the time that I heard of, okay. yes. So you had been to Shad's father's house and Shad's mother's house, correct? Yes. And fair to say that um, <clears throat> you'd been over to the um, apartment on Eastman Avenue where Taylor Shavizis was living, correct? Yes. Yes. And, sir, you'd go over to that residence to kind of chill or hang out, listen to music, watch TV, whatever, correct? Yeah. Okay. You had Taylor's phone number? I had her Facebook. Okay. And if, as far as Shad Therian, you had his phone number or Facebook information? Yeah, I had his Facebook at the time, too. Fair to say that all three of you, yourself, Mr. Gannon, Taylor Shabizis, and Shad Therian, you all had each other's contact information, correct? Yes, but um, after, like, after, like, a rough, like, pact with, like, a friend, I was, like, chilling. I just started dissociating when I just like I do that a lot for the past 10 20 years I just like if I feel like people don't if like if there's like a sort of discrepancy I just like cut you off it's like block you or whatever and then that's that's the reason why the day before that situation with the murder I I hated I hate Taylor because I just wanted to associate again okay so now Taylor Shavizis has a father. Do you know her dad? Yes. Okay. His name is Arthur uh, Arturo Coronado. Is that correct? Yes. <clears throat> Had you been over to Arturo Coronado's house? Yes. And it was was that with Taylor? Um, it was uh, not the. This was like maybe like a year or, or like so before, I. I visited. There's, I, there's been very few times since I personally talked to Art. So. Okay, but had you been over to Art's house with Taylor in the past? Yes, I have. So you kind of knew Taylor pretty well, fair? Yeah. Okay, and you knew Shad very well, correct? Yeah. Um. 
Was it was it such that there were times when maybe you'd be hanging out with Taylor and Shad where they would be using marijuana together? Prior yes, acts aren't um, wait, wait. Um, no. Stop. Okay. Uh, Your Honor, I'll withdraw. Thank you. Questions withdrawn. Okay, ask another <clears throat> question, Mr. Freilich. Um, did you see um, Taylor Shabizis on February 23rd of 2022? February 23rd? Yes. No. How about the day before on February 22nd of 2022? No. You saw her on February 21st of 2022, correct? That was a Monday? I don't know when, what day that was. Okay. There's, there's, that's just a little bit too out of my, out of my polymath. I'm sorry. Okay, that's fine. But you did all hang out together and you drove over to Michael Therian's house. Is that your testimony? Michael Therian? Yes. I think, like, all I remember... I, I'm, I don't... I, I'm not... I, I don't know. Okay. So You're not good with dates, correct? I'm better with dates, just not, like, recently up for, like, the past five, ten okay. years. So That's fine. So, when prior to you being told that Shad Therian was deceased, <clears throat> uh, the days before you were told that, um, you were hanging out with, with Shad and Taylor, correct? Yes. And did you notice anything odd about Taylor as far as her mannerisms, her eyes, her speech, anything like that? No. Did you um, have any feelings that she was acting weird when you had contact with her? Bizarre? I, no. Okay. Had there been occasions where you've seen her and you felt that she was acting very odd or unusual? Object, judge. Relevance. Mr. Freilich? Well, I think it goes to his observations of my client, Your Honor. then you need to narrow it down with it for a time frame for him. Um, so I'm going to sustain the objection, ask, ask another question, Mr. Freilich. Okay, sure. In the, uh, Mr. Yenna, yes. in, in the week before you had contact with the police where you talked to the, <coughs> the officer, had you, <coughs> you, you saw Taylor Shabizas at that period of time, is that fair? Yes. And did you, when you saw her, was it just one time or was it, uh, several times. It know? was only one time. Okay. And that so. one time when you saw her, did you observe her to be acting in any kind of bizarre manner? No. Okay. Okay, nothing further. Thank you very much. Sir. Any redirect? No, Your Honor. Thank you. Thank you, sir. You can step down.